he might have made a good president, or a general, as confident and capable as he was, as tall and commanding. No less than John Wayne himself looked up to this man, saying, he was my mentor, my ideal. I wanted to be like him. But if director John Ford had become president, he wouldn't have made such masterpieces as She Wore a Yellow Ribbon. Three Godfathers, and they were expendable. Fortunately, John Ford chose directing as his life's work. And in November on Turner Classic Movies, he's our director of the month. John Ford was a thoroughly American director who forged brilliant cinematic images out of the raw Western landscape. A man with a vision big enough to capture the Wild West and bring it to the screen without sacrificing any of its beauty or its grand scale. He was a hard-drinking, hard-living, salt-of-the-earth man, so rooted in the rough-and-ready tradition of the American West that he gave his Westerns an authenticity no other director could match. He was John Wayne's alter ego behind the camera. The John Wayne we know was as much John Ford as the Duke himself. You know never to apologize. It's a sign of weakness. Yes, but this was your last patrol, and I'm to blame for it. Only the man who commands can be blamed. Rests on me. Every Friday in November, Turner Classic Movies pays tribute to John Ford with some of his finest work. Ford Apache. They were expendable. She wore a yellow ribbon. The Informer. Mighty Joe Young, and more. So get ready to stand your ground like a man and taste the red dust of the West with our tribute to Director of the Month, John Ford, beginning with Three Godfathers, this Friday at 7 Eastern on Turner Classic Movies.